Hey, welcome back to our Stupid Reaction TV. It's I'm Corbin. And with me, as always, is Rick Siegel. Bala Mogulis. Bahal Mogulis. Ah, yes. We are the faceless, stupid gods. Ow, that actually hurt. <laughs> Please follow us on Instagram. Instagram. Today, we'll be reacting. What are we reacting to? Uh, it's called Game of Thrones. What? Nudity Explained. I've always wanted to know this. It's a stand-up comedy bit by, uh... Read that for me. Sorab Pant. Sorab Pant. Does he do it naked? Uh, no, I think he just explains the nakedness. Oh. Yes. Okay. Uh, we are big Game of Thrones fans. We can't wait for next season. April's coming. Please let us know if you are fans as well. Just like winter, April's and coming. who's your favorite character? It's Tyrion. Tyrion. Ned. He's dead. I don't care. <laughs> I love Ned Stark. <laughs> Anyways, but, uh, so this should be fun. Uh... I don't know what he's gonna say. <laughs> oh yeah, spoiler alert. Okay, I don't want to see her all sad behind that. And it's, uh, it's um, like it is basically turned into this amazing TV series. Okay, how many people here love Game of Thrones? How many people love Game of Thrones? Yeah, yeah, Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones fans love it. Love Game of Thrones. How many people have never watched it or don't like it? How many people? Yeah, no, that's okay. That's fine. What's wrong with you? That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> It's not. Don't let the world judge you. It is funny. No, it's not. I'm judging you. Dude, I love Game of Thrones, but like people are like, you have not seen Game of Thrones. Oh my god. It's true. You have not seen Game of Thrones. Oh my god. <laughs> when did you get diagnosed? Oh my god. <laughs> you have copies of the Lego. <laughs> you must have gotten me in the eyelids. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sitting in the under. <laughs> so big deal to watch Game of Thrones. <laughs> I gotta make one of my relatives watch Game of Thrones, right? I tried my level best, and ten minutes they're like, "Yeah." <laughs> but the thing is, if you've read Game of Thrones, you never see Game of Thrones. You say, "I've read the Song of Ice and Fire." Okay? <laughs> Give me credit for a Song of Ice and Fire. <laughs> and the thing is, if you've read the novels, right? The whole purpose of reading, let's be honest. Is so when the TV show, the movie comes out, you can tell me like, "Where for my own time?" Yes, I'm only one. I have confidence. George R. R. Martin fucked all of us <laughs> because he's created a separate plot for the books and the TV show. So we were undermined. My wife was watching Game of Thrones. I read about the four, first four books of uh, of A Song of Ice and Fire, and she's like, "You know what? I think Jon Snow is going to die." I'm like, "Ali, tension with me." <laughs> I knew that though, you don't worry. <laughs> yes, I put you over, you chill up. And then he died. And my wife was unaffected because that's not the first time that I have disappointed her. <laughs> Just saying. Um, Game of Thrones is amazing, man. My, my favorite, uh, John Soto, he keeps dying every day. <laughs> he wakes up in the morning. I think he thinks death is sleep. He's like, how many hours did you die yesterday? Eight hours. <laughs> <laughs> now, the one thing that I find about, about the TV show, which I, I don't think people understand, I don't think people understand the purpose of the nudity in Game of Thrones, right? People, there's a lot of nudity in it, right? Like, come on. Everyone knows. <laughs> but I finally figured out why it was. It was basically there's such dark shit that happens in Game of Thrones, and then you see something nice and it makes it okay. <laughs> Equality. What 
Game of Thrones started doing in consequent seasons was that they started showing the men's <laughs> area as well. And <laughs> like your Westeros and all that. And <laughs> the thing is, nobody wants to see it. <laughs> Because he just, it was the way he turned. <laughs> Ned Stark died. Boobs. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I missed, I have to go back and watch it because I missed the next 30 seconds after that. I was still <laughs> dying because I had the picture of his face in my head saying that word. Yeah, it's very funny. And he's actually right for those of you who've watched Game of Thrones. Yeah. This is exactly what this that is, symbolizes. Yes. <laughs> exactly. George R. R. Martin, you're a genius. <laughs> Finish the last book. <laughs>